E can also make segments of circle or arcs. To define a three-point arc, which is the default, always enter the points in the order start point, end point and some point on the circumference. If geometry already exists, then PowerShape will snap exactly to it using the intelligent cursor. PowerShape E will also find tangency conditions. In this case we're making an arc that is tangent to another arc and a line. An arc that is tangent to two lines. In this case we will change the radius to 12. Or an arc that is tangent to three lines. Any combination is possible without having to use a special icon option but simply by watching what the intelligent cursor is doing.